are our souls at stake. Let's give it our best. Let's take them back. Back to the Bible. Welcome to Reaching the Lost Success Strategies. One of the most underserved communities in our nation is our Spanish-speaking communities. Now, we have a lot of Spanish-speaking people coming to this nation. We already have a very good base of Spanish-speaking people scattered throughout the nation. And a lot of our churches are really just not addressing our Iglesia de Cristo members, that is our Spanish-speaking members of the Church of Christ. We need to give them resources. We need to help them. If you've got Spanish-speaking people in your community, you need to be reaching out to them. So at the School of Evangelism, we've done a couple things to help. First, we have asked Marlon Ratana to be one of our regional trainers. Brother Marlon Ratana speaks fluent Spanish. It's his primary language. Brother Ratana and his good wife, Jackie, have also now uh, come to the United States to work with World Video Bible School and he has started the Spanish Bible School. You'll see the website on your screen. You can go to that website. He has a lot of tools. These are tools, downloads, materials that you can use to reach Spanish-speaking people in your community. In addition, he's taken our materials like the Evangelism Simplified Guidebook, and he's translated it, and we printed it. He's taken back to the Bible. Translated, we printed it. Does it matter? Believe the Bible and other tools. So now you can reach out to the Spanish-speaking people using evangelism tools and the model. So let's make sure that we don't ignore them. Let's make sure that we reach out to them. Let's use the tools that we have. They're growing just about every single month. For example, Brother Marlon Rotana has taken Believe the Bible. He's taken Back to the Bible. And at World Video Bible School, he has filmed the virtual Bible study. He's also taken our seminar that is our five lessons that teach our principles, and he translated that as well. And so there's, again, many tools available, but you got to be aware of them. So you can go to the worldvideobibleschool.org website, go to the Spanish speaking or the Spanish Bible school. You can contact us and we'll be glad to provide these for you. Efforts need to be made in our local communities to reach out to Spanish-speaking people. We need to be going to their door. We need to be trying to communicate with them, providing access and resources. Some of us need to start a Spanish-speaking congregation within our building. It's okay to do that. Use your fellowship hall. We need to be looking for men who are willing to dedicate themselves to the full-time work. Contact the Brown Trail School of Preaching. Contact the Southwest School of Preaching, the Memphis School of Preaching, and other schools, and ask them, do you have a Spanish-speaking student, someone that's graduating? We need to get them into the field as quickly as possible. If you have neighbors, friends, maybe they're not fluid in English, but you can give them, again, Spanish-speaking material. In fact, you can take the English version of Back to the Bible and the Spanish version And brethren, you can probably get through it. In fact, we know people who've had conversions doing that because they know just enough English. You have just enough Spanish to make that connection. The early church had struggles with languages. In fact, in the early church, we know that the speaking in tongue gift was given and provided to help cross some of those language barriers in the very early parts of the church to help it spread more quickly. We also have tools today. You have a smartphone. There's going to be a translating app where you can translate languages. You can speak English. It translates it into Spanish. So here's where you're at. We've got tools. We've got technology. We've got trainers like Marlon Rotana. And, and he's got training materials that have been translated. So I wanted to encourage everyone. Let's not forget our Spanish-speaking communities. Let's not leave them behind. It's a, a world of people that need us. So elders, preachers, let's make sure our churches are serving, not just us, but let's serve our whole community. We really need to get out to the Spanish-speaking people. May God bless the church in America to reach as many people as we can, and may souls be saved. We just plant and water, then watch God see the increased stars. There are souls at stake.
Let's give it our best. Let's take them back. Back to the Bible.